What is up, guys? It is your boy Phil Shocker, the United States of Dog here, and I'm sorry if I sound a little low and everything like that. It's because I am tired. I've been up. It's currently around 6:22 in the morning. No, 6:32. I'm tired. And I was meant to record this video about a day or two ago, I think, but I just didn't because I was tired or something. I don't know. We are going against my man, George. If you guys don't know who George is, you need to know. His channel link and stuff will be in the description down below of this video. This is the final week of APM, and we actually did this battle in call, so it was a really fun time. We had just a good chill time, got the talk and everything like that. <sighs> it was just a really fun time. I really enjoyed myself, and it was just overall great. So, yeah, let's go over his team here. He actually brought about half of what we expected. He brought his his main so his main abuser of rain this week is gonna be the bear tick. He brought bear from which we knew he had to bring, and he brought Pelipper, which we obviously knew he had to. Phalanx actually surprised me since Phalanx really doesn't have that good of a matchup, and so did the Rapidash. So Rapidash didn't have that good of a matchup, if I'm being completely honest with you as well. Arcanine was definitely something we could have saw come to this game, so he definitely wasn't bringing his best team versus us, so. Let's just go ahead and get into the battle. So, I'm going to go ahead and lead off my Dragon Bolt here. He's going to lead with Arco Doggle, a.k.a. Arcanine here. I'm just going to click U-turn here. There's nothing else I can do here. I'm going to go in there with Quillvish as he goes for the minus one. Then he clicks Flame Charge here, and he actually breaks my stats, which is very unfortunate right here. And right here, I had a big play I had to make. Right here, there's two plays I could have made. I could have, A, set up my Toxic Spice, since I knew he wasn't going to bring Defog on that Pelipper. Or, I go in for the Liquidation, which actually will kill the Arcanine, if not set it up for Aqua Jet kill range, or range of death with this thing. And, I just click Aqua Jet. <sighs> and now his Arcanine basically dies on a switch in. I'm going to go ahead and drag a pull here, and I'm just going to click Shadow Ball. There is no reason not to. And right here, his Phalanx is going to get two hit KO'd, and drag a pull finally picking up more, finally picking up a kill. In comes this thing. I'm going to go ahead and just switch out into my Raphael. And he actually finds out I'm the tech of the power outside of Sun. And uh, right here, I decided to go for the, I believe is the Ancient Power or my Stealth Rex here. I go for my Stealth Rex here. And right here, I. It does reveal to have debug. I'm going for the ancient power here, and we just chip him down. I had some plays I could have made right here. Uh, that crit, um, that crit. I don't think the crit ultimately mattered because there was a high roll chance he could have killed me. But he was probably rocking some special attack investment and stuff like that. So I don't think in the end that crit really mattered. So, but I'm gonna go with little Mac here, and I'm gonna go ahead and just click bulk up here. So he goes into the Ferrofarn. I'm going to like Thunder Punch and Rain, get a crit, which really also means it doesn't matter here. But right here, I'm just clicking Bulk Up. I don't know why he would do that. So he's going to go for the Leech Seed here. I'm now going to click Drain Punch, get all that juicy help, and he lived on one, which it was a damage roll, but he luckily got the roll in his hair. He's just looking terrible, knock, try to knock me out, but he ain't going to do that. So right here, I have a lot of plays to make here. He goes into the Lapidash here. I really wish I had clicked Thunder Punch. I really wish I had clicked Thunder Punch here. But right here, I just go ahead and sag off my Hitbox and it doesn't do too much else in this matchup. The rest of his team is severely chipped. I go Durin here, and I'm just going to click Thirst Impression, and we pick out the KO on the Farrakhorn. So there goes one thing that was really stopping his team. In comes Nigel here. I'm going to go ahead and click Rock Slide. We knock him out. Out. He was actually max HP, but we always knocked him out from that range. He actually reveals to be Scarf with Healing Wish, and that actually led to he even admit that that was actually probably a misplay on his part, because now with that gone, without him being Scarf, he has no way to check. Well, he didn't know if I was potentially Scarf, but that. But the problem is now he loses i think because he didn't speed creep my speed creep here and i luckily land my rock slide that rock slide was something i needed to land 
He said it was apparently a roll that I uh, got killed right there. But in comes Dragapult, and I can just click Shadow Ball here. Dra oh, not click Dragapult. So check that Dragapult here. He's going to go into the Bear Tick. He's going to reveal that I am Scarf. I click Dragon Pulse here. as It's my only play. He does go for the Ice Soul Crash and knocks out my Jet Fighter. And at this point in time, it's going to come down to me versus the world. His rain goes out. I click Cosmic Power here just to make sure I can live the hit. But he misses his attack. And that's when I just decided to click Air Slash just to pick up the kill here. And then Sai goes down and he's going to die to his own Life Orb hit. And that is going to be the GG's to my man George. And we are going to win this game 1-0. We're now 1-1 one one with George. Whoo, that was a close game. Uh, definitely, if it came down to it, if he had landed and I lived this here, I can just click Roost and he can't kill me. So in the end, he would have just died to his own life orb there. So we had won this game unless he crit me. Which, would have, let's face it, would have happened to me. We know I'm my luck this season. But um, yeah, so we basically won this game regardless. It would just have been a slight stall, which I would have hated. Literally would have hated if that had to be the case. And that's just the regard. But I think overall it was a good match. Um, but yeah, one on one versus George. That's gonna be awesome. We ever get a rematch? The urban match is not come to be. So, yeah. But, yeah, that's going to be the final week of APM. I am pretty sure, I'm pretty 99% sure we are guaranteed playoffs. So, it's going to be very interesting how playoffs are going to work for us. And I will say this. Um, we will not be returning to juniors. I don't know. If I get, if I get promoted, I may do, may do the promoted part, but... If I am stuck in juniors, I am going to take a break from APM because with just one game really getting to me, and that was the one game that mattered so much to me there, it just made me so angry. I will say that the last week's game where if Ace had a max HP shiny flop, had max HP slide on, then fine. Okay. I mean, flop, flop. No way, Baron. Then okay, I'm not too mad about that and stuff like that, but you know, it is what it is, you know. <sighs> Excuse me. But um, yeah. But that's gonna be the game, guys. Oh, uh, we again, GG's to Port, GG's to my man George, and the season was just relatively great. I think we had a lot of good mods on this team. Regardless, Dragful finally put in some more work this week, picking up two kills. Chainsaw picking up some massive three kills this game, dude. That's super. That's good. Well, actually, he only technically picked up two. Which is a little sad, but, you know, it is what it is. You can't help it. But, yeah. Hit my chan though, again, oh, if I had clicked Thunder Punch, dude, and I got that para, I would have probably won with Hit my chan himself. Well, actually, I wouldn't say that. Because if he's defensive Pelipper with special attack investment modest, maybe, I don't know. It would have came down to this, but if I got rid of that Arcanine turn one, he or she would have been really in the back burner right there. Really would have been the back burner. <laughs> But yeah, that's going to be, again, I, I'm sorry for rambling, but that's going to be the game. Definitely like, comment, subscribe if you haven't already. Subscribe to me. Subscribe to me. Subscribe to George. And until next time, guys, I'll see you in the playoffs of APM. Peace.